So welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. Episode 3 of the Road to Glory series. Um, I've got quite a few updates to talk about because um, I had to restart the series again. But don't worry, it's for the good of the series itself. The only difference, and I'll talk about this when we get into it, but I've had to, like I said, I redid the first two matches. So we drew the first game, we won 3-1. However, as you can see, we actually played different teams. Because when you restart a Master League, you don't play the same teams. I did this probably four times, and then and it was never the same. And I was like, well, it's never going to happen. So... The first match, apparently, we took on Sheffield United now. Uh, and then the second game was Bristol City. So we are going to play Huddersfield Town again twice. And we are going to have to play Barnsley twice. The reason I've done this, though, folks, is because I now have tactics set up for literally every team in the game, which is madness. I paid like $10 for this guy who's doing it on Discord. I can leave a link for it if you're interested. But it's crazy and i was like look fluid formation and tactics is what makes master league and makes the teams play a lot different so this is what i want to show you real quickly if we go to yeah something like team info right so someone like the premier league you pick a team like leicester city go to their lineup you can see they've got the fluid formation okay that's been added now normally it's only the top leagues but this guy has done it so we go to like barnsley for instance bosh there it is fluid formation that's been done. Someone like uh, Millwall, for instance, go to game plan, fluid formation. All the teams literally have fluid formation, which is hopefully going to make this even more entertaining because that's when you start seeing the juicy stuff. I played FIFA the other night streaming and it was so boring playing against the AI. Couldn't stand it. So having all these lineups done, and I even think, like, I don't know if League 2 has been done in the French League. Yep, that's been done as well. So that's crazy. We have hundreds and hundreds of tactics set up for all these teams. It's fantastic. So I'm going to leave a link for his Discord in the description. It takes like two minutes. This is only available for PC. As I said, I paid this for my, for my own money. I, I'm not self. I'm not promoting him because he's given me something. No, I paid him $10, $10 to get this myself. And I'm doing a bit of promotion for him because the, the amount of time it takes to do that for all these teams is madness. So props to him. Right, that's out the way. Second of all, Gamescom. It's coming this week, ladies and gents. Remember that. So we're going to be covering eFootball. They are meant to be there. Konami have clarified eFootball is going to be at Gamescom. And then we've got FIFA 22 news as well. So all that's going to be happening this week i don't know how much of this series we're going to do but don't worry we'll get right back into it when the news dies down um so that's the second point number three what was i going to say oh right regarding the xp right you guys are going to have to work with me here while i sort this out now in the last episode you saw it i started adding a few pop-ups just to make it a little bit more interesting and i also want to do negative xp so if i concede a goal i lose xp i don't want to just gain it the purpose of this playthrough is it's going to be tough it's going to be difficult and i don't want the progression to be easy we are going to be playing on legend difficulty i'm just going to go for it we're going to be still using the same gameplay mod um, but let me know in the comments what's a good milestone to get to do you think a thousand xp and we get a new sponsor do you think 2500 what do you think because the main way i'm going to be doing this is you score a goal 10 xp um and then other things will start accumulating i'm gonna make the first season folks there's a lot of arm movements here i'm gonna make the first season very simple okay the xp is not gonna get carried away because i i i want to just get the series going and doing the editing i'm realizing how much time this is going to take to do but i still think it's gonna be a bit of fun all right so we'll keep the xp simple and sweet in the first playthrough the first season uh, and then we can adjust accordingly. Right, that's all of the news out the way. Sorry, it took me five minutes just to talk about all that. Um, but if you do want to check out those tactics, as I said, link in the description. Doesn't take long. You put your edit file in a few things. It imports it. It does it. Job is done. But you will have to restart your masterly. Okay, so, ladies and gents, this is the news, okay? We are in the last day of the transfer window. As I said, I had to restart, unfortunately, to get all the tactics. But I think it's worth it in the long run. Um, now... We, we, we're not really going to be able to buy anyone, uh, ladies and gents, because this is going to be very difficult with a salary budget of only 4800 It's not a lot. It's not a lot. I mean, if I go into the budget settings, we're pretty much receiving everything on the salary budget apart from contract options and fan favorite bonus. 
I think we may have to just do all receive. We'll do all receive a salary for now to try and get some money. However, one thing that I do want to do, and I think we may do this, is we have had an offer for Kazim Richards. Now, I know he scored a brace in the last game. But the facts are, the guy is 34 years of age, right? There's no progression on this guy anymore. He is declining quite heavily. He's already down to 72. I don't see much worth of keeping him. We could sell him and we'll get 4.3 million, a little bit more money on the salary budget. And then I was thinking, because there isn't a lot of scouting, honestly, there's no forwards. They haven't come back with any news for me. I don't really think I need a center back right now. I would probably want to do this and try and promote this guy, Simic. Because I know he's only a 69. But he's only three less than Kazim Richards anyway. But he's only 17. The, the, the chance of progressing this guy could be fantastic. You know, he's a 74, 75 speed. His jump isn't the greatest. But I think there's potential. And he's in the youth squad. So if we were to compare, can we compare him? That's just, you know what we do? We'll add him to the listed players. Okay, if we go to our team, we'll add Kazim Richards in there as well. No, that's not what we want. I'm going to do a little comparison here, just real quickly. And these episodes may be a little bit longer now, folks, while I'm talking the old talk. Um, so, yeah, if we compare, use him as a comparison. There we go. So, we compare them. Um, Kazim Richards is going to be on the left, and uh, Simic is going to be on the right. So, Simic already has better offensive awareness, which is good. Ball control is not as good. Dribbling's about the same. Tight possession, Simic is a little bit better, and low pass. Um, Richards has, what, better lofted pass, a little bit better finishing. Although the finishing isn't bad, 71 for Simic. Heading is a little bit better for Richards. He'd have to work on it. Place kicking's not great. Kel's not great. Speed's about the same, actually. You know, Simic is a little bit quicker. Uh, Simic is better at jump. Kicking power is about very similar as well. Physical contact you'll need to work on. A little bit better balance. Stamina needs to work on that as well. Uh, better at ball winning. Defensive awareness is quite similar. Injury resistance is really good. Um, they're exactly the same height. The other guy's got a lot more weight on him. A little bit more bulkiness. Um, but obviously he doesn't... I don't think he has any player skills, so we'd have to work on that. They're very similar. And for an age difference of... What is that? 10, 15, 17 years? 16 years? I can't do maths. 18 years, I think. I think we might as well go for it. So... I am going to do this. I'm going to sell Kazim Richards because why not? Uh, let's make this playthrough really tasty and honestly just try and, and grow some of these youth players, which is the game plan. It, it's the game plan. I really do want to try and excel in that department. Uh, we have had a bit of an offer here. We've got I'm a 24-year-old. Hmm, from Barcelona. Yeah, we can comp uh, clear these comparisons. Thank you very much. Uh, but 24 is still a little bit old for me. You know, I'm looking at someone around the 20-year mark. All right, forget that for now. Although we did have another one here. Let's have a look at what's going on with this one. Uh, Jonathan's a left back. I wish they'd all have real faces. Oh, I've also added some faces. Um, let me show you those real quickly. Thank you to Raul Duke, uh, who sent these over absolute legend so where is it listed players no nope, that's not going to do it how do you look at just the squad squad list there we go so the players that we've added with a new face um i know i said wozniak but i thought this is how you say his name josniak zilzniak and a lot of you are saying that guy's name is uh so we've got knight he's got a new face there you go looks pretty good we've got bird that's a cheeky smile looks beautiful kind of got the old grealish hair um, this guy, Burn. You said his name is Spur. Uh, you say it, Burn. Beautiful. That's easy to pronounce. I can't butcher that one because, yeah, I was like, B B Bernie? Is it Bernie? <laughs> so he's got a new face. He looks decent. Uh, Bushinen, he's got a new face as well, although I think he already had one. Uh, and Sibley as well. So thank you, uh, Raul, for shooting those over, mate. If you guys have any more, of course, uh, send them over. Was there any other players I had? No, I think that was it. Now, I know we've got Duncan as well as a 19-year-old. Hmm, he's not bad, actually. I mean, he's only a 66. No, we're going to go for... Um... All right, let's do it. So we're going to go to youth team. We're going to get Simic, because I know we've got this Yu Luling 
um, guy as well, who's a bit of a winger, a little bit more versatile. But no, we're going to go this guy. He's young, 17. I think there's potential. So we're going to snap him up. Bosh. So there we go. There's our official first signing for us. Yeah, there isn't going to be many signings, people. Don't, don't expect us to be signing players willy-nilly, not with the funds that we have. We've got a little bit of a better, a better salary, salary budget there. So we may... We may... No, we're not going to sell Shinny. We may grab someone else. Because Davis is another player I really want to try and get rid of. 35-year-old. I think we will go and have a look at another centre-back, to be honest. Okay, um, we've got Forsyth. Another full transfer. I mean, he'd free up a little bit of room. How old is he? He's 31. Um, and then we've got Bushinen, which we'd probably play him more. Have we got any other left-backs, though? That's the issue. Uh, we've got this guy. Well, we'll put him out on loan. Is it a loan? Yes, it is. I know we could also exchange players as well. We could loan in players. I just... I don't like doing the whole loaning thing because I feel like... On Pez, it's, it's broken half the time. You know? Uh, last day of the transfer window, chapter deuce. Uh, Rotherham are asking to buy Brown for 400,000. Right, do we really need to sit down and have a discussion about that? And I really hope the game doesn't freeze today. Please don't freeze on me. It's doing my head in when it does that. Uh, someone said Waghorn to sell him as well. Well, we can't go too crazy selling all the players, you know, because we haven't got enough time. All right, who else do we want to... Right, let's actually figure out who we maybe want to snap up. I'm actually going to go to the youth team again. We've got this guy here. Santini. A 70-rated centre-back from Italy. How old is he? He's 20 years of age. And then we've got this guy who's 18. All right, you know what? We're going to add him to the listed players. We can do a bit of comparison. Candela. I'm also going to add this guy. Because I think we do need a centre-back. You know, that's, that's the heart and soul, isn't it? And we have a lot of youth players in the middle that we're going to play anyway. A lot of them are 18, 19 years of age. So, actually, no. I wanted to put Davis in there real quick. Sorry, folks. There's going to be a lot of talking at the beginning of this video. You can skip ahead if you want to the matches, but... I like to, to tell you guys what's going on. Keep you guys in the loop, obviously. You guys are part of the board. All right, so there's Davis. Let's use him as a comparison. And if you compare him to Santini with the lovely hair. So Davis is on the left. Santini is on the right. Santini's got a little bit more pace. Actually, not bad. 70, 72. Stamina's pretty much the same. Balance is the same. Not quite good on the physical. Jumps a little bit better. Ball controls better, dribbling, tight possession, exactly the same. Defensive awareness. Uh, he's got really good injury resistance, actually. About the same height too. A good conditioning. Hmm. I honestly think we might just snap him up. Uh, and then we have this guy. If you compare him, not quite as good as uh, Davis, but he's a little bit younger. You know, he's 18. He's an anchor man, which is interesting. Which so he's more of a hmm, an anchor man's more of a DMF though, isn't it? I would say. Ah, you know what? I think we're just going to go for it. Let's let let's pick up Santini. I like the I like the sound of his name anyway. Um, it's too large. It's too large, folks. Okay, well, with it being too large, I think what we'll go ahead and do is uh, sell Davis here. He's 35 now. All right, we're going to sell Davis. We will accept that. Bosh. So we'll get a tiny bit of money. Nothing too crazy. A little bit more on the salary budget as well. We've got five hours left. So let's go ahead now and, uh, yeah, let's snap up Santini. I think he'll do nicely for us. Badoosh. All right. So we're doing a bit of business we've got a centre forward and a centre back but they're both from the youth squad so we technically haven't really bought bought anyone um, I might do a little bit of XP for that we'll see I still need to find out the exact details of all this XP stuff because there could be many ways to gain XP but I don't want to get too too over the top alright negotiations my team so yeah we are getting a lot of offers coming in I, mean, I don't want to sell these players Lawrence no 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 how old is he I mean he's 26 yeah but I can't no, I've got to keep some experience in this squad. Otherwise, it's going to be a nightmare. Um, Burn. Someone's come in for the old Bernie. Uh, we're not going to sell him, though. 
Forsyth, I think that was... We could sell him. Forsyth. Another player that's getting up there. 31, 69 rated. It's not great, is it? Maybe we could switch him out for another left back. Let's see. What do we have? We've got Jonathan there. Actually, let's look at the youth squad. Honestly, we might as well. I've never really used the youth squad, so it would be quite fun, I think, to mix it up and, and definitely use them a lot more. Uh, this one's got interception fighting spirit. It'd be nice if one of them had pinpoint crossing. Well, that one's got the heading trait. Who's this? Krau? Kraus? The German? Who's this guy? Cross specialist. He's going to play all over the shop, can't he? It'll really be between... If we wanted a right back... But I kind of need a left back. Hmm. All right, let me make some decisions. Um, and then I'll let you know what I do. All right, folks. So I found this guy. I did a little bit of scouting here with this guy. I know a lot of you have left recommendations on the Discord server. And I've been looking at a lot of them. The problem is the salary. Like, the player looks good. And then they want a salary of, like, 20-odd thousand. I don't have that kind of money. And we've got 12,000 now. It's gone up a little bit. This guy actually looks quite good. Um, he's from Bromby. He can play as a left back and a centre back, but we primarily play him as a left back, maybe a left midfielder if needed. A lot of speed about him, 87, 86. He's 22, so he's not too old. I want to keep like all the players I get. I want to get young players. All right, that, that's what I ultimately want to do. Just grow the squad. Dribbling isn't bad. He's got good stamina already, 83. Balance is solid. Um, I mean, his conditioning isn't the best. Weak foot accuracy, whatever. Don't use your right foot, mate, if you don't want to. And injury resistance is, you know, a two. Conditioning is kind of meh, but... Doesn't look bad, does he? And he's not going to cost me an arm and a leg. So I think we'll put in an offer for him. Because they only have a release fee of 1.9 million. And he says he has a good, you know, a good vibe. So we'll give him about 8,000. We'll see if that works. Obviously, these release fees are a joke. And you kind of just have to live with them. So we'll go ahead and do that. The only problem I have is... We may not have enough time to do this. Because I think we are going to need to sell a player before we can actually get him. So let's have a look here. Yeah, so if we accept it, that's the problem. Ooh, we've only got two hours left. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. So if we were to sell someone, because we've got a few more offers, um, I mean, we could sell Forsyth because we're kind of getting rid of a left back, keep another left back, and he is getting eight, you know, he is getting on a bit. No, we don't want to do that. Except this is like to be the last contract. Yeah, that's the problem. Ah, we're gonna run out of time. I can't even believe that. I can't even believe it. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if this works. Um, it probably won't because we run out of time, as I said. But we're gonna give him this guy Brown or whoever I just did. Can't remember his name. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if this works. We only have an hour left, so I don't know if there is time to do this. If there is, then we pull one out of the old rabbit hat. Uh, let's have a look. They've failed. Hmm. Aye! All right, never mind then. Never mind. Forget it. Well, no, I mean, we'll, we'll add him back because we'll probably look at snapping this guy up afterwards. Oh, well. I, I should have probably looked before, but it is what it is. All right, so we bought, you know... Yeah, we'll just proceed to the next day because... There's no real point in doing anything else. We've got Brown. I mean, do we need this guy... It's fine. We don't need to sell anyone if we're not going to get anyone else in. Because we're just selling for the sake of it. So, there we go. That was transfer deadline day, folks, in a nutshell. It took us a lot longer than probably expected. So, yeah. That's that. We may only have the one match then today. Because, honestly, that took way longer than I thought. But we are in the FA Cup. Bosh. So, we'll probably... Actually, we'll probably do this. Play the one match today. And then the next episode, we'll get back to two games. Uh, because we are actually playing Swansea back-to-back. -back. Uh, we, we've got the luck of the draw there, haven't we? So we're playing them in the FA Cup. And then we're going to play them in the league. There's a look at the schedule. 
All right, so let's go ahead and pick a lineup for today. I am going to use fluid formation. I'm going to use the f the formation that was default when I started and when I actually downloaded this thing. So I'm going to go ahead and just leave it as it is. And I'm going to see how the lads play. Oh, there's Santini. Look at the size of his head. That is a whopper of a head, isn't it? So we're going to have him and Ed Munson at the back. Uh, Simic is actually up for today. Maybe we could play him. I mean, we've got Waghorn, who's probably going to be the... the better player, as you would expect. But, um, no, let's try Simic today. We will maybe try and get a face for him. I don't even know if he's... Is that a real player? Don't really know. Uh, we've got Morrison playing as an AMF. Anyway, let me pick a lineup real quick instead of talking, and be right back. All right, so we're going to go for this. I mean, look at that spirit. A 46. Yeah, this, look, we are going to play on Legend, all right? We're not messing about in this playthrough. We are playing with the gameplay mod, as you know, the Pez 17 revised. We'll, we'll play with it for a while, you know, 10 or so, Matt, 8 to 10 games. We'll see how it holds up. If you guys like the look of it, then we'll just continue to use it. But, you know, I want a challenge, so that that's the point of this. Don't be expecting me to bang thousands of goals in, but... We'll get there. We'll get there. We've got a lot of youth here. You know, as I said, Edmundson is 23. Santini is 20. Well, this guy's 28. We've got Shinny's 29. This guy's 22. We've got a 19-year-old, a 22-year-old, a 26-year-old, a 27-year-old, a 17-year-old up top. Most players under the age of 25. So, potential. Potential. So, there we go. 46 spirit. What we will do today, though, is I'll play anchoring on Simic, which I like to do anyway with the, with the center forwards. Defensive on uh, Billick, and we'll play deep defensive line just because I'm a little bit concerned with Legend. You never know what's going to happen. Um, so, yeah, it's probably smart to do that for the time being. So, there we go. That's the lineup. And what we're going to be playing on is as follows. We've got to change that back to Legend because, yeah, I put it on Beginner while I was quickly plowing through the games. Uh, we'll play 30 minute games. Um, normal, fairly hard, as you know, for the negotiations. Um, small budget and all that stuff so okay there was a lot of talking in this episode i apologize but i wanted to get it out of my system and obviously we got decisions to make um we're gonna have a bit of an issue here though because those kits might clash and we only have mm, i'm hoping they're gonna be okay don't really want to give them the away kit we should be okay with the blue shorts and the uh, the peachy purple socks i need to come up with a a third kit possibly so anyway i will see you guys there let's dive into the, the fa cup gets underway on legend let's see how we do so here we are folks ah the emirates fa cup live from the liberty stadium we got a nice little turf mod as well i did put this new turf sort of lighting mod um so we'll see how this pans out looks pretty decent to be honest so yeah, the way I'm going to do this with the XP, I'm thinking that if we concede in the last five minutes, we lose double the XP. So instead of 10 XP, we'll lose 20. I'll figure some stuff out just to make it really intense for those last five minutes where I'm going to wet myself. Don't concede a goal, Ricky. Don't do it. And if we do concede, well, we're going to have major problems. So anyway, yeah, the kits look they should be fine. Anyway, I will show you guys what camera I'm playing on. A lot of you ask. It's very simple. It's dynamic wide custom. Zero, zero. That's what I like to play. I know some of you will say, why not play on the, the stadium cam? I just, I don't play well like that. And I just like to, to play on dynamic wide. And honestly, I've, I've tried this in the past. Some of you say it's, it's better to play on dynamic wide. Some prefer on stadium. It's, you know, it's all personal preference. Anyway, let's dive into the action. I'm going to keep a, a notepad next to me in case things do happen and we can whack some XP down. Uh, but yeah, if we do concede a goal, remember we lose 10 XP. That's not going to help the cause. <laughs> Welcome to Legends. Oh my goodness. This is going to be um, quite difficult, isn't it? Well, they worked it well, didn't they? Straight through the old pie hole. Lads are half asleep. I mean, our team spirit isn't there. This is what's going to happen in the opening few 10 or so games. We've got to get the team spirit up. And it's a, it's a simple finish, isn't it? Comfortable as you like. All right, we're going to go 4-3-3. I've turned off the fluid formation. So we're going to go 4-3-3 right now. I'm not crossing this in because it's an absolute waste of time. So, But then again, so was that. That's all right. We may have a shot here. 
Well, Santini's a centre-back, but he says, I'm still having a go on my debut in the, the first team. The keeper's going to launch this out. It will not change to uh, Josny out there for, for some reason. All right, here comes Morris up against Knight. Manny, hold him up. Brilliant challenge, Knight. Ref, put your, put your arms down. It's a physical sport, son. Don't let him turn. No, not on the right foot. Brilliant challenge. That's what we like to see. Right, chance to bring this forward. Flick that one off. Oh, blimey, where do we go now, though? This is so hard, isn't it? It's very, very difficult, but that's the purpose. The challenge of the year. Shinny. All right, Lawrence. Oh, Shinny's made the run. Lovely play. Flick that inside. Simic. Knight. Oh, just about to hit it. Maybe come out the ear hole. All right, Burn. Knight. Let's fire it high. Looking for Lawrence. Couldn't win the header. Oh, it's a bit of a risky ball back. Freeman's taking a little bit of time here. Finally manages to clear it away. Lawrence. Simic. It's not a bad idea. Go on, Knight. Oh, ref, ref, he caught me. Oh, it's, so, it's really difficult, though, in the final third. And I'm also concerned about Swansea catching us on the break. I'm liking this gameplay mod, though. I mean, it feels fair. It feels challenging, but it feels fair. We're getting a little bit more into this. And this is the momentum shift. This is what happens in pairs time and time again. And this is where you... Now, nah, just the arc. This is where you have to make the most of it. If you get those chances, you've got to put them away. Because if you don't, well, it could be curtains. Here comes Freeman. Billick, stay with him. Feel inside. Deander. Swings it round to Manny. Gets it down on the old chest. Burns tries to come across. Wins the challenge well. Uh, and we could have a chance here through the middle. Simic is on the charge. Unlucky, mate. Keep going, though. Keep fighting. And that is half time. It's been a tough half. It has been a tough old half, but we are, we're still in it. We just need a goal. ASAP. All right, we've had a chat with the boys, and the second half will get rolling. Yeah, I mean, the stamina's looking all right. The team, I mean, the team feels fine. It's, it, it, it is purely, that's a poor pass. It's purely going to be down to the spirit. We're going to have to wait a while. Once we get to maybe the 60s and the 70s, then we'll start maybe grabbing some... Uh, some results but at the beginning of this playthrough what on earth is that what are you guys doing at the back no idea Swansea's doing what we do all right well if that's going to be the case maybe we can score from a corner oh there we are Santini Knight get that down so we get back into the mix it's high towards the back post Simic oh he's offside I tell you what I'm surprised the goalie didn't come out there it's a delicious ball in that's a brilliant save reflexes of an absolute ninja Right, we're going to go a little bit more attacking. I think it's about time. Simic. Ah, Simic, Simic, Simic. Here's Bennett. Oh, he's lost it. Dangerous place. Chance now. Come on, Simic. Poke it through. Finish it off. Oh, he's offside. Oh, it went in as well. Look, it was a goal. Chalk that one off. What's offside about it? Or is he given a foul? What's he given there? I don't absolutely no idea what the ref's given. He's given a foul for a shot. It's an interesting decision, ref. Here's what it is. Anyway, here comes Freeman up against Knight. Floats it high. Clearance away. I've got an itchy nose and I can't itch it. It's going to annoy me now. Chance for the strike. Big deflection. Comfortable for Mr. Hughes. We've, we've given him a shot today just because he's the younger of the keepers. Uh, and he's going to be playing a lot more than uh, the 35-year-old. God, it is so hard when the lads feel like turtles. All right, Edmundson. Knight. It's just, it's hilarious, you know, because I'm so used to playing with all the top teams. Although, that's not a bad idea. Simic, come on, steal it off him. Oh, unlucky, mate. That's, that's, that's good stuff. Keep working for it, Simic. That's what I like to see. You'll probably give you five minutes and you're coming off. Cleared away. Grimes. Finding uh, Ariola. Freeman. Now take it. Like it. Grimes again. Deander. Grimes. They just play so much better with these mods. You know, there's. They play patient football. They take their time. 
It's so much more human-like. And then you add the fluid formation. That's what makes these games so much better, I feel. You need fluid formation. Otherwise, every team will play exactly the same. Manning. Ah, he's done me like a kipper there. Great play. He's getting crowded out, but he's done well. Morris. I've still got, an, I've still got it's the schnoz. All right, Lawrence. Little flick. Lovely. Morrison. Flick that one inside. Simic. Oh, a move. Dozniak, you're in. You're in, son. Brilliant. Come on. Give on. Oh, you just can't get the extra yard. Ah, burn. Come on. There you go. Knight. Swing it around the other way. Flick that inside. Morrison, I think we just shoot this. We do need to shoot it. Comes back towards Knight. And it's the... Well, we we'll take it because that was going to hit the corner flag. But all right, we're going to bring on Waghorn and I hope we get something from this corner. But that's better, lads. All right, well, we went out for a goal kick. Uh, anyway, two changes Waghorn and Jordan. Ib. There's Lawrence. Bilic. Knight. You guys can see how slow my players are, right? Oh, blimey. All right, Jordan. That's not a bad idea. Knight. How's the old finish? He gave us a little bit of room there, but Hamea was uh, pretty comfortable for him. He gives it a good spanking forward. Santini completely misses the header. Shinny's going to knock that one back. All right, come on, lads. No time to mess about. No time to do dally. I mean, Swansea, for them, it's fine. They'll take this. One nil's enough to put them through. But well, we've got a chance here. Waghorn. Billick, go on lads, finish that one off, yes, come on, get in, I'll tell you what, the feeling of scoring, when you've got no spirit, Josniak is there, is it Josniak, Josniak, it's a bit of J with the old diddly diddly on it, makes it complicated, but great play lads, we'll mark that one down, 10 XP, thank you very much. Well, this is going to open the game up, ladies and gentlemen. We've only got the one match in today's episode, and uh, this may be heading to extra time. Who knows? But it's a great finish. And it's game on. Tries to clear it away. Yozniak now. What is that for a ball? I asked you to put more power on it than that, son. And I win the header. He's missed it. Deander. What on earth is that for a name? Someone's just... Just someone's just randomly made that name up. That's not a real name, surely. Anyway, Deander once again. No, don't let him swivel. And luckily, he's missed the frame. This is this is like trying to climb Mount Everest. You know, we've only got one leg. It's not the easiest thing to do. It's doable, but it's certainly not the easiest thing to do, is it? Luckily, he missed. All right, welcome back. Extra time begins. So Knights had a little bit of uh, a stamina boost for the time being, but it won't last long. Great header by Santini. Yes, uh, here is Grimes. Another ball in Edmondson gets it away. Lads, we still the FA Cup games, you've always got a chance, even on this type of uh, team spirit. You know why? Because the opposition, as we know, play crazy. A Waghorn's in. Finish. Oh, he's hit the bar. Oh, my goodness, mate. Keep it alive. Oh, he's done brilliantly well. Wozniak there. Our oh, referee takes us down to Chinatown. And that's got to be a yellow, surely. Nothing. Unbelievable. And that close, they're scoring, folks. Ugh. Right, well, I honestly don't... Honestly, I'm not shooting this. If you have a look right here, no one's even marking this, lads. So, like, keep, keep, your, uh, keep, your, keep your ear to the ground, folks. We're trying this. Right, here we go. Go on, lay it across. No one marking him then. Free effort. Oh, he's missed the target. No one wanted to mark him. It was a free chance. You mark like that, you're going to pay the price. But unfortunately for us, they didn't pay the price. <sighs> Frustration. So it's a fair way out for Grimes. I don't think he's going to go for the shot. Number four is calling for it. And that's who he's looking for. The ball's flicked on. We're going to nod that clear. Here is Waghorn. Nicely done. Oh, get forward then. Play him through. Go on, that's it. Knight. Ah, uh, Knight's got... He's, got gonna, he's not going to win that. It's far too... Uh, far too knackered at this point. We'll probably bring him off. Start the second half, maybe. All right, here is Knight now. Well done. Keep going. Uh, that's a good challenge. But Knight says, I'm going to ride that challenge. Brilliantly done. Finds Jordan. Keep going. 
Lay it back. This time. Oh, it's another decent save, but it's not the best finish. Josniak tried to float it over the top. Lads, you've got to put away these chances. You, you can't keep having the chances and missing the ball. We're missing the goal. We're missing the net. Billick finding Burns. Or Burn. Why do I keep saying Burns all the time? Someone from the Simpsons. Oh, Jordan trying to get through the middle. Lawrence. Josniak. He's onside, ref. Oh. They, they, they did well there. They pushed the line up. Look at that. That's smart play. You see all the centre-backs push forward. Duped us. All right. Away we go. I forgot to take Knight off. So um, Bird is going to come on as soon as that ball goes off. Come on, lads. They're there for the take in Swansea because, as I say, cup games are ridiculous on this game. Oh, it's lovely play. Surely this time. Waghorn. Yeah. And away he goes. Oh, he's been brilliant, Waghorn. He's always constantly smiling. <laughs> but no, he's he's a good player up top. He started Simic. He has got the super sub trait. We're going to mark that down as uh, some more XP in the bag. Beautiful. We still haven't won it yet, folks. We still have 13 minutes on the cards. But this is all about the one-two. The give and go. Completely did the defender. Took his time and slots it outside of the boot. Bit of a weird finish. But we'll take it. And a change. There is your confirmation. The bird is coming on for the night. And elsewhere. Um, they made a change as well. We're going to go defensive now. We are going to push the players back. as Because uh, this is... No, no. Don't... <laughs> It's not even a surprise, is it? And the goalies are not really that good. So you can kind of shoot it straight down the middle and score. Unbelievable. All that hard work to score, folks. And then and Swansea just says, well, you know what? I'm going to rub this right in your face. I knew this was going to happen. I knew it was going to. You've got to stay on four. The marking's terrible. <sighs> All right. Well, the XP's gone again. That's another 10 XP gone. Right, back to the drawing board we go. Two apiece. Penalties are still looming. And I do not want to do penalties. I really do not want to do penalties. Oh, that looked like it was going to be a foul there. All right, Santini, Edmundson. Be careful, lads. They are they are knocking forward, aren't they? Here is uh, Jordan. Give it to Waghorn. He's been the influential player since he's come on, but not with a pass like that. What on earth was that for a ball? Good block there by Billick. No, 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 no. Watch out, lads. Deandra. No. Oh, that was lucky because that was... That was close. Swung around the other way. Roberts. No, it's, not, it's not an elbow to the face. He actually did get elbowed there, but he didn't give the foul for it, which is nice to see. I don't know how many subs we have. If we can do more subs now or not, do we get... Can we actually make another sub? Oh, we can. Okay, I think we've changed it. So we can actually do more than three subs, which is nice. Do we want to take off Josniak? I think we're going to have to at this point. Yeah, we'll take him off. All right, good shift, mate. On comes Mitchell Law Law Lawson. Let's say Lawrence. It's Lawson. So when he comes for the final five minutes here. Swansea deliver one high. Keeper, pick it up, please. Thank you. All right, let's go, go, go. Don't mess about. Here comes the bird. Jordan says, I'll take it. I'll tell you what, the switch is on. It's a fantastic ball if it actually switched players to the right player. And we could have had a chance there. Long clearance. Great little touch. Lawrence once more. Here's the bird. Jordan. Looking inside. Lovely play, lads. Lawrence. Waghorn. Looking to open up a couple of yards of space, and that's a late one. He did get the player first before he got the ball. We don't have many free kick takers that are very good. But this is the time that we need to pull something out. Yeah, that's a little bit cynical, isn't it? The guy with the absolute mental name. Well, this is, this is it, isn't it? I mean, we've got Lawrence at a 74. He's going to be our best, best taker by far. All right, this has got to be the moment of truth. 
Come on, Lawrence. Do the business. Have we put too much on the old ball? Yes, we have. All right, final two minutes. Final two minutes. Is this going to penalties? That's the question. Have we got one final chance here? We may do. Lawrence, poke it through. Oh, Lawrence, you took too long. Deander. Bennett. Oh, no. Look at the space out wide here for Cullen. Santini, you're going to have to watch the middle, son. Get it away, Edmundson. Oh, we've pressed the wrong button. We got the wrong side of our man. Clear it away again. I mean, we've still got to do penalties here, and we know what's going to happen. It's going to be an absolute mission. I can't believe the first FA Cup game. Go into penalties. Strap yourselves in, ladies and gents. Oh, this is going to be really difficult to win this, but we're going to try. Okay. Here we go. I mean, our best penalty takers are 74, and then it depletes quite rapidly. I'll be honest with you. So, it's going to be the Swansea City first. And this is all about... It's the game of luck, isn't it? It's a game of luck. It really is. All right, which way are you going? He's going that way. He's going that way. It's a left-footed player. We're going to go... Oh, he was going that way as well. Uh, the net sounds, by the way, I can't remember what net sound I have, but I'm using sound server, so I, I've upped the sound of the nets and stuff. I mean, do they know if I do this where we're we going? Uh, surely they don't. Right, we're gonna we're gonna go for absolute power. Lawrence, surely he's the best penalty taker we have, so of course he knows where I'm going. Heaven forbid that he doesn't know where I'm going. We're playing on legend. All right, he's going that way this time. It's gonna be Cullen. We're going that way! Makes the save! To be honest with you, I don't even think I pressed that way. The game just decided to do it for me. All right, we're just doing this. Well, this, this will tell me if, if the game knows where I'm going. Oh, ho, ho, ho! Waghorn straight down the old pie hole. One apiece. Which way is he going? He's going that way. Oh, I thought he missed it. That's a good penny, though, isn't it? Top bins. Oh, God. I don't know if we should follow him. Well, we're going to have to go down there. Or oh, have we put too much on it? Come on, Jordan. Please do the business. You muppet. How'd you miss the target from there? Well, it's going to be Smith. I was going to stay down the middle. Ah. Well, folks, we tried. I don't think... I think this may be it. A bit of a shame. A bit of a shame. I don't know if we should just go down the middle. We'll just go that way. Anyway, it's going to be the Mr. Bird. Yeah, the goalies. They know. The way <laughs> That's the problem. Like, if you get to penalties, the, the, the animations of the goalies cracks me up because they just dive like Superman into the corner. But oh, well, we got a defeat. We get, we get eliminated from the FA Cup in the first round. Not great. I mean, we should have won today. We hit the bar. We had chances. Six attempts to 11. And uh, Danda is your man of the match. So there we go. So the first round, the other results. Uh, Huddersfield Town won. Uh, Wickham Wanderers did win. Cardiff City won. Millwall lost to Nottingham Forest. Norwich beating Barnsley. Um, we have Preston North End beating Middlesbrough there. Coventry lost to Brentford. QPR did win. Blackburn won. Watford won. Uh, and Sheffield Wednesday winning as well. So there we go. Short-lived, wasn't it? Short-lived season. We didn't even make it into the second round. Who is... Uh, who do we just play? Swansea. Who are they going to play next? Liverpool. Well, forget it then. Forget it. You're having a laugh? Playing Liverpool on Legend. Yeah, Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to end it there today because we are going to be back to take on Swansea again. I'll give you guys a day to digest all the fun stuff. Uh, then we're taking on Swansea and then Middlesbrough. Um, but I thought the gameplay was decent, you know. Yes, it's going to be a struggle. Yes, the team spirit sucks big gonads. But we'll get there. And I'm going to stick to Legend because that's the challenge. Playing on Superstar and dominating games all the time, it's no fun for me anymore. So there we go. Anyway... We'll be back shortly. Sorry, it's only one match, but we'll have two games going forward. It was just a lot of talking at the beginning of the video. So, yeah, it is. We're in transition. Damn right we are. We're going to transition into beasts, but it'll take a bit of time. But until next time, subscribe for more. And take care.